The karma act is a diabolic and evil Alors intended act. It says they can change a board of trustees and no changer. court can obtain it. Why will I respect an act that does not respect the law? Well, you know, somebody will say that, okay, in America, in London, government regulate charity organization. That's true. I should tell you what happens in America. I should tell you what happens in London. We have about eight churches in London. We have about 30 in America. So I should tell you what works there. In America and London, a charity organization can collect grants from government. Government will give them. They will apply for grants. Government will fund them. In this last pandemic in America, I know churches who got $80,000, $100,000 supported by government. So when you support charity organizations, you have a right to regulate them. Is it this country who will apply for $100 million government will give us? If you give us, then you can regulate us. We are not anti-government. Me, some weeks ago, I paid $4.6 million as tax. I paid to my state as tax. They taxed me and I paid. Oh, you are surprised. Oh, you are believing all those nonsense you see on social media. That pastors are eating tight, eating off. If you open our mouth and talk, what happens behind the scene? The tight and offering for this church that comes from this church is used for diesel. You know, this last time when there was a lockdown was my best time because I saved a lot of money. There were no members to ask me for rent. There were no members to ask me for money. I was just enjoying myself. The very Sunday the church, the open church, four million naira left me. Rent. You are, you are saying we are, we are helping. When we see members like this, I mean, there are some pastors who are eating money. That's their business. All these men of God you are mentioning, how are they rich? I will tell you. The people who they invested in years ago are the ones now taking care of them. I'm just telling you how pastors get money. Let me just open up to you. There are people I raised up 16 years ago. I trained them in school, did everything for them, and today they are taking care of me. You say I should reject what they are giving me. They swear for me. And there are some of you now who I am supporting, many of you. I'm taking care of you. In the next five, six, seven years, God blesses you legitimately. Won't you take care of me? This is the secret to pastor's wealth. So I'm not just speaking for the church. I'm speaking for all charity organizations. If the government does not fund you, they cannot dictate. Imagine them saying that when they do it, even if you go to court, the court cannot abba. That's military regime. It is evil intended, it is maliciously planned, it is not right, and it will not stand. So the government should let sleeping dogs lie.